Hi everyone, we're uh, playing pure chess. Uh, we're at the main menu. We're going to chess challenges. Uh, we're going to take uh, bonus games and we are going to go to the mate and four set. And today we're tackling problem number 16. It's while well, it's loading up. Uh, once we get there, if you'd like to hit pause, go ahead and do so. Okay, let's analyze the board here. Uh, we have. Uh, uh, for black, they have a, a rook on b1 that pretty much blocks our flight squares. Uh, what we're worried about is um, black using their power to crush us. Uh, but the more important thing we have here is how do we solve for mate and four? Well, we've got this bishop here on d2. I'm not sure we can use a lot of it. Uh, we have a knight on f3. Uh, not in a great position. We'd like to use it if we can. We have a knight on h3. Uh, again, we'd like to utilize it. We have a queen. Uh, we'd like to utilize that too. And we've got a couple knights we'd like to utilize as well. Uh, black obviously has the queen, the, the rook right there. Uh, the dangerous rook at b1, which I mentioned earlier. A knight that could give us some problems. A bishop, a couple pawns defending. Uh, but the good thing we got for going for us is we've got a couple knights here, and we've got uh, these three pieces right here, or we'll call it our offensive triangle. And what we're going to do is use these as a battering ram to take out Black's position and bring more pressure than they can handle. So uh, the first maneuver to the battering ram is going to be queen takes h7 check. That piece is defended by the knight, and the knight captures that. Well, that's okay. We're going to continue the battering ram. Uh, rook takes h7 check. And the king only has one flight square because, if you remember, we got a, uh, a knight right here that's covering these, and another knight right here that's covering these. Okay. Uh, next move in the battering ram is to slide our knight over from f3 to h3. Check. Black didn't have any flight squares. Black's only option was to block with this bishop right here. As remember, we've got uh, those squares covered. We've got these flight squares covered. Basically, the only open spot is h8. All we have to do is take take the bishop uh, or the rook on uh, h6, and we have solved the problem. It's checkmate as black has no flight scores. And uh, that wraps this up. I am signing out. Thank you for watching.